Hi, I'm Devin Hoekstra, Precision Egg Consultant covering the Iowa region. And today I'm gonna to be talking about the Connect Mobile app. This is what our Connect Mobile app looks like here. Uh, we open it up and it's gonna ask us to log into our My John Deere account. For the time being, we're gonna do a demo so you guys can kind of see what's going on. We're gonna hit view demo and we're gonna do planting. So we can see the planter going through the field right now. Right now we're set on singulation. It's planting at 99.3% singulation. If we are viewing this dashboard on the right hand side, that is an average. But if we view the map itself, we are seeing the skips and doubles down to the row. And if we look at our legend, uh, we can see that the blues are gonna be more of a multiple and the reds are gonna be more of skips. So we can see that once we click on the planner quality manager, we can see each row and its singulation and how the skips are on each row, multiples, actual population, and our seed spacing down but to the row, which ones are performing well and which ones aren't. So if we have an issue with one of them, we can see that instantly. We can also see that we can mark flags on this where we have a flag marked over here outside the boundary, but if say we wanna mark, well, we've got one marked up here as well. And this is, if we click on it, that's actually a rock. Um, so once we get into the proximity of that, you'll hear an, an audible tone. That's gonna let us know that we're getting close to our flag of a rock, weeds, or anything that we need to mark out in the field. Our alert settings on singulation we can set a high and a low on our acceptance value, and we can show for different amounts of feet on the distance applied. If that singulation drops below, let's say 94% in that thousand feet, it's gonna alert us. If we click on actual population, or again, over here on the right-hand side is all averages. And if we view in down to the map, we can see a, seat, a row by row uh, seed drop here. Same with target population, our seed spacing CV, applied downforce row by row. I know this is a, a big ask from a lot of customers being able to see that downforce change across the field. So you can see we've got a flag nearby notification that came on here. So we're getting in the proximity of that rock there. Another one in our dashboard is gauge wheel margin. Again, row by row on the map, average on to the right. Our last two on our dashboard are ride quality. So we can see the ride quality of the planter as it's going through the field and our ground speed. So if we wanna see our ground speed changes around corners or how that's affecting our planting, ride quality, everything there. So <clears throat> how we drop a flag is we click our flag sign there and we decide where we want to put that. We're going to say that right there, there is some weeds or a tile inlet. Let's go with tile inlet and we're going to associate it with this field and we're going to say new tile inlet. If we want to, we can add a photo and we can turn on our proximity notifications. We can set our different proximity. So if we want 300 feet, 50 feet, 200 feet, all the way up to 500 feet. So for this one, we're gonna do 50 feet. We're gonna hit save on that and save again. So now this also shows our variety here. If we have a variety change in our planting, we can see that as well. So we can change what our map looks like on live data or past data. So we can view 2020 data the variety and we can click that and we can compare that next to each other. And that's about all that there is for the Connect Mobile app.